come with us as we cross the Ontario New York border for the first time. So before you cross the Ontario New York border, you need to do your research to figure out which bridge you're going to take. Fun fact, there are about eight different bridges that you can take from Ontario to cross into the state of New York. We decided to take the Rainbow Bridge as we wanted to see Niagara Falls on the US side. You can actually check on the website where you can get live updates of the processing times on each bridge. We left home pretty early in the morning because we are anticipating a lot of traffic and we spent approximately 35 minutes stuck in traffic. Upon reaching the checkpoint booth, we were asked to submit our passport and once you are a non-Canadian citizen or a non-US citizen, you are also required to show proof of a US visa. After presenting proof of our passport and U.S. visa. We were advised we had to proceed to the U.S. Customs and Immigration Building for further processing. Upon entering the building, we were asked to be seated and await our names to be called. The total waiting time was 25 minutes and once our names were called, routine questions were asked and we had to pay the I-94 processing fee of six U.S. per person. 